Carlos Ramirez, owner of NVS Audio, Roselle, New Jersey. Keith Dube from Dube's Customs trusted us to upgrade the audio on his brand new GMC Sierra HD. Um, he started by installing his remote level controller um, that he custom builds in the center console stack. So just under the factory radio and it came out super, super clean. Then he uh, trusted us to do the rest. So he wanted a lot of bass. Everything that Dubes does is extreme. So uh, we reached out to our friend Chris Pate at MTI Acoustics and had him build us one of his custom level five or stage five enclosures. I asked his recommendation. I didn't want to do a seat lift or anything like that. It was a brand new truck. Um, he says he really likes the way the Gel Audio 13s sound, so we did three of the 13s um, under the seat. Level 5 enclosure with the acrylic and the bracing. Closure looks really, really good. Factory fit and finish, like all of the MTI Acoustics enclosures. And then um, Dube actually rode down from uh, Mass to and stayed here for a week while we did the build. So having the enclosure done before time saved us a ton of time. We completely sound dead in the car. We sound dead in the doors. Um, we built composite plates for the doors because the factory front speakers are six spot iron. So we did um, all Hertz speakers in the car. We did 28 millimeter tweeters in the dash to replace the three inch factory twiddler. We did, we swapped the six lines in the doors for um, Hertz Malay Pro six and a halfs. We did Hertz Malay Pro six and a half coaxes in the back doors. Um, and we ran big power to all of this. The bike has an upgraded alternator. I'm sorry, the, I'm so used to doing motorcycles. The truck has upgraded alternator from the factory and it's got the dual battery setup. So current was not an issue. We did a Sound Digital Evo X2 5000.1 to power the 13s. We did two AD audio 1200.4s one bridge to the doors, the front doors, and uh, the second one ran the tweeters on one and two and the rear doors on three and four. So it's a nice active setup. We went with a Hertz H8 DSP, ran everything active. Tweeters have their own channel, rear doors have their own channel, front doors have their own channel, subwoofers have their own channel. Um, RTA tuned it, time aligned it. The truck sounds phenomenal. But uh, here, check out the build. Got it, baby. Today's the day. A week here. Sweet. Been waiting for this for months. Look how beautiful that is. That's the OEM panel in the 2023 Silverado. Here's the knob. There's the power indicator on the right and the clip indicator on the left. 
let's get this thing fired up. Thank mm -hmm. you. 